Plainfield North and Nequa Valley meeting in the sectional final for the second straight season. Tigers got the better of the Wildcats in last year's matchup, but NV beat North earlier this year 12-5. Starting pitcher Justin Hicks in a jam in the second. Connor Peplow singles to left field. That drives in Brady Miller from third, putting the Tigers on top 1-0. Game tied at one in the fourth, Plainfield North having a meeting on the mound. Tim Schneider with the only RBI for Nequa. The senior gets his second run batted in with the fielder's choice at second. Evan Raniclef scores to make it 2-1 NV. Wildcats coming up big with two outs. After a single by Tyler Tesman, James Gargano finds the hole on the left side. Tim Schneider getting waved home at third. He'll score without a play at the plate. Nikwa now up 3-1. Gargano fired up. Next up is Ryan Wheeler, and the junior chops one back up the middle. Tyler Tesman coming round from second, avoiding the catcher, sliding and safe. Cats up 4-1 after four. Justin Hicks giving up only two hits through four, having worked through some trouble in the fifth. But Dylan McCarthy sends a shot back up the box. That'll get the job done as DJ D'Onofrio comes in to score. Tigers cutting the lead in half. Hicks telling Robin Runner he wants one more batter before he's done, and the manager gives the okay. The senior rewarding Runner's confidence, striking out Gavin Doyle to end the North rally in the fifth. One of five Ks on the day for Hicks. Keegan Bates on the bump for the Tigers in the bottom of the fifth, but Tyler Cristofaro welcomes him to the game with his only hit of the day, driving in Jack Ragoni. Mason Lebrecht comes in to finish things off as Nequa avenges last year's loss, picking up the 5-3 victory. Wildcats win their fifth sectional title in program history. Earlier in the week, like Thursday and Friday, practices were uh, they're just really serious because we, we knew we had to get revenge on them, so that was like our main uh, focus. In the bullpen, I felt good. I was be able to locate my fastball, everything, um, and that gave me some confidence to go out on the mound and just attack the hitters. Our goal, obviously, as every team, you know, every team dreams of state, dreams of winning state. But for us, it was a legitimate, like it was a goal, like we could actually accomplish it. And you know, coming here, playing Plainfield North, of course, it was a little revenge and it felt good. But we weren't really focused on who we were playing. We just want to get to the next game. Seniors like Tim Snyder and Eric Nelson and James Gargano and Tyler Cristofaro and and Hicks and Lebrecht. Those guys were in this situation last year, and they knew what it was like. They knew what it was like to walk off the field a loser, and they did not want that to happen again. And they are very, very good leaders. Uh, you know, I just kind of leave them alone, and, and, you know, they work with the younger guys very, very well and, and keep them locked in and keep them focused, and um, they are the consummate senior leaders.